What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Hey, what's going on, people? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, and I'm back in the building. And today I want to talk about a topic which you guys need to be afraid of. And I brought Jonathan good luck because we don't know how you're going to do it. In three, two, one, now. Jonathan's asking the same question I'm asking. A lot of these black churches out here don't know what they have done by sponsoring gay marriage. Well, not they didn't sponsor it. They co-signed it. They kind of gave it their approval. And we're going to talk about this. The black church. How are we doing today? We're, the black church... It's supposed to be a, a, a statement, a symbol uh, from the black community. I'm going to talk to you today about something different. Now, the black church, we all know how it is in the black community with the church supposed to be the head and everything. Right? Everything runs out for that. But here's what you guys have done. You guys are uh, 501c3, mostly non-profit organizations. And you're saying, well, what does that mean? To me? what does that, what's, what's that got to do with anything? Well, see, now that you gave gay marriage a cosign, they can come to your church and get married. And I know what you're thinking right now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, they're not getting married in my church. Well, here's what's going to happen. You're going to either have to do one of two things. And I think you're going to do the first one. You're going to either A, render unto Caesar, which is Caesar's, which a lot of you guys are going to do anyway, which you've been doing behind the closed doors. Or you're going to actually go by your faith and say, look, we'll go for profit and we'll pay these taxes. Now here's, here, here, let me go on. People don't understand that if, say a gay, married, gay, gay couple goes to your church and says, I want to get married. And they, you say your pastor, this, does, this, this is churches, period. This doesn't have to be a black church, be a white church, a Hispanic church, any type of church. Synagogue, and anywhere. And say the, the, the presiding, whatever you call them, the person that presides over this, this temple, building, whatever, tells them no. Well, they can go to, the, to their local government and say, hey, look, this is a Section 501c3. They don't pay no taxes. I'm an American. I pay my taxes. They're profiting on me paying their dime, and they won't marry me. What do you think going to happen? As I said before, you're going to have to do one of two things. Either going to have to render unto Caesar, which is Caesar's, which I think a lot of them will be doing to begin with. You heard it here first. Or two, you're going to say, no, we'll, we'll go for profit and we'll just, you know, let our faith, we'll go by our faith. See, a lot of these, a lot of these pastors already, you already know they're taking money for homosexual organizations and homosexual people. We all know this. But you can't call them out. You want to know why? Because it's supposed to be a secret. It's no secret. Get out of here. But the fact's going to remain. We're going to see if all this stuff you've been preaching, if you really 100 with it now. Because now your foot, your feet are going to be thrown to the fire. Because now the black church is going to be like, well, uh-oh. See, here's the problem with that. While you guys were co-signing this, you didn't weren't thinking down the road. So, once again, it goes, it goes to... Uh, how they say you, you, you vote for something and slit your own throat at the same time. But then you want to say since we were slaves, we can understand. Well, I understand something about getting lynched and that's what you guys just did to yourselves. You lynched yourselves. The black church, churches in general, I'm not saying, I'm not just going to pick on you guys. I'm picking on you. I'm saying the black church because a lot of these guys are taking, been taken homosexually from donations and they've been and they've been supporting homosexual marriage on a low low, but now it's time to say when they come come to those doors, and we're gonna say, well, what does God say? That's what you're supposed to say. But I know a lot of you guys are gonna render under Caesar, which is Caesar's. A lot of you will not do what you do. You'll keep your father one C three, and you'll have gay marriage. And then nobody will get disgusted because it'll be the church and oh, what a great day in civilization, blah, 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 blah. So, I want to let that put out there. If you're a 501c3, your ass is going to get held to task. 
So you got one or two, one or two things to worry about. Are you going to render? Like Crespo Dollar was bad. He got that jet just in time because he can go to profit. Well, that jet's already paid for. But that's all. Other than that, you're going to render under Caesar, son. So, I'm out. Peace.